Hey everyone, it's your friend Think Noodles, and welcome back to my Let's Play. I'm here in my desert, and uh, I want to try something as sort of a proof of concept before I go and build it into a machine. Uh, and that is turning a uh, string or redstone into obsidian. Um, there's sort of a, a mechanic, uh, or maybe a glitch, I don't know, but it's been in Minecraft forever. And uh, it has to do with placing things, um, or placing lava in regards to, um, or I guess in relation to uh, redstone. Uh, so let's see what happens here. We'll just put a hole here, put the redstone there. Um, so yeah. Uh, and uh, also I did notice when I was just looking at myself that I did the wither battle without a helmet too. So that might've been why it was a little bit harder in the last episode. Just making excuses, I know. All right, we got some glass here. Let's see. Um, now, I think it's like, if you, I think it's like, uh, is it like this? Um, no, it's not. It's like, we need to bring this up. Come on, let's do this. So yeah, I think like this, then you put water. Jeez, why do I not know how to do this? Um, we're gonna need more blocks here. Yeah, okay, so uh, yeah, I might have to close some of this off to be able to see it. So we put it there. Uh, jeez, I'm I like I can't even think. <laughs> uh, okay, let's put that there. But that th then it's gonna wash it away, isn't it? Let's see what happens here. Um, no way, it won't. Because if I do this, it should it should just let's try this. Um, yeah. Oh, right. Just um, yeah. This should wait. What? Yeah, that. Uh, like that and it should just flow down let's see oh, I didn't bring any water oh and I think I should have an empty bucket over this way well my speed boost doesn't does it I can't tell um yeah okay yeah it is working okay there it is all right so let's um get over here try it out I think it's like this oh there's my jump boost boing oh that makes that makes that easier doesn't it uh let's see what wait no, that's not right. Move this. Uh, this needs to go back one, so it'd be like so. Yeah, and then um, hold on a second, guys. Let me think this through. Okay, I think. Oh, you know what we need? Oh, is this silk touch? Nope. All right, it's fine. We'll just. That's what we need. We need that. And then the water will flow next to it and not into it. Yes! Okay, now... <sighs> after all of that... Okay, so that's what we need there, and it's getting dark. Um, We should be safe here, if, especially if I put a couple more of these out here. I mean, zombies might bother us, but we should be pretty safe um, to be in the dark here. Not have to get creepers blowing it up. So uh, then all we need is some dirt here. And I think if we. Uh, let's do that. Get over this way. There we go. Oh man, you guys. Really? <laughs> get out of here. Okay. Uh, so now if we put lava over top. It should make this into obsidian, the the uh, the redstone, but it won't break the lava. So let's see what happens here. And we'll show you. I don't know if this still works. Yes, it does, but I didn't block that, so that's gonna make a mess. Come on, block it. There we go. So um, as you guys can see, uh, right, and that's why I used glass, but you know I didn't have enough. Uh, as you guys can see, there is obsidian there. And it turned the redstone into it. And what? Oh, my jump boost doesn't extend, does it? Ugh, annoying. Uh, and as you guys can see, I can go and I can pick up the lava. And, well, I'm not really sure why that's there, but uh, as you can see, we can get our piece of obsidian here. Come on, break it. And whee! So, yeah, it did get obsidian. And we still have the lava block. So, or the, the, um, we still have the lava, uh, source block. Uh, in in the, in the I guess in the uh, form of the bucket. So 
Uh, let me get some materials together because uh, the way I want to do this is semi-automate it um, so that, uh, and you can really automate it, but um, I'm not that good. But uh, what we can do, and maybe we'll make it more automated later, uh, what we can do is um, make it so that, and also it doesn't have to be redstone, it can also be string. Um, that where I put that, uh, but I don't have a lot of string right now, and I think we can trade for redstone. I have a lot of redstone anyway, um, and I just I don't have a oh man, but I can. Well, okay, whatever. Let's just break this, and uh, I'll be right back once I collect the materials that I need. Um, I'm gonna need some more lava buckets, so I'm gonna have to go down to my branch mine and get underground and all that stuff. And uh, how many do I, I got? One there. Um, but yeah, I'll have to find my buckets and stuff, so I'll be back. Alright guys, here we go. Um, we're just gonna put glass here because I think that it, um, I don't know, I'd rather see everything uh, that we're doing here, so that should, yep, that should do it, and okay, good. We need to use our infinite water source trick here, and I'll just make it a, a, a triple instead of a quadruple. Wait, do I have enough for that? Do I have to use three to make that work? Let's find out. Uh, I think I only have to use two for the triple still. Yep, same thing. Okay, nice. Okay, so uh, we should be able to put this here and it'll flow right in. Nice. Okay, so yeah, just do that and we'll just keep doing that. Uh, dun, 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 dun. Hey, give me that. Give me that. There we go. Yeah, you got to use, I think on that, on that infinite water source, on the, on the square block, you can use any. But on this one, you always have to use the middle one, which is fine. I, I don't really care. All right, so there we go. And fill this one, and that should be it. All right, we're good. Nice. Oh, fill that one. Okay, cool. So we got that. Let's um, let's pick up this one, and pick up this one. And will it? No. Ugh. All right, we'll just fill it in because I find that annoying. Okay. Uh, all right. So we've got this. It goes into there, and this is where our stuff will be. Uh, this is where it'll come out. Now, uh, there is a way to do this with dispensers. So, um, I'm going to try this. I've seen it done. I just want to make sure that I do this correctly. So we want to put them here. Um, and I think it's dispensers. It might be droppers. Um, so if the dropper goes there, it should. Yeah. So yeah, we want them there. And, um, I think if you, if you pulse trigger these, we'll see in a second. I'll just put a lever on one of them and see. Uh, put a lava bucket inside, and it should. Let's see. Um, oh, no. We, we want it further out one um, because we want it to go right over top of the, um, of the uh, redstone. So let's do that. Don't break any glass, please. Thank you. Um, I think I missed one. Yep, there it is. Nice. Okay, uh, put it in. Oop, put it in this spot here. Are we facing north south? Yeah, I thought I, I thought I made sure of that. Oh, and that guy's not facing the right direction. So we want it like so. Yep. Uh, nope. Wait. Oh yeah, that's where the redstone is. I'm like, I'm getting so confused. Let's get that. There we go. All right, there we go. And oh my gosh, come on. Why you do this? Okay. Uh. Mm. Done, done, done. And this is just so I don't have to keep going down to my branch mine to get them. I know you can make, um, you can make, uh, what do you call it? Uh, and we probably want to make sure that this lava doesn't go anywhere. Um, I know that you can make, uh, uh wither based farms, um, where you can actually have the wither do it for you. Uh, but I'd rather not. <laughs> Um, because I've read, from what I've read, uh, those guys, those wither-based ones, um, sometimes they mess up. And sometimes they mess up on multiplayer and the wither can get out. And uh, I would want to keep it close to home. And, well, you guys know uh, how that goes. So, All right. So let's give this a shot. See what happens here. And all right. So we should be able to trigger this. Let's see. And it should make us obsidian. Bingo. And what happens? Okay, that's what I was worried about. Okay, wasn't sure if that was gonna happen. All right, let's just let's just calm down. <laughs> uh, did I shut that off? Did I get that back? Uh, can we get that back? Where's where's the bucket? Let's 
All right, so I'm glad I made it out of non-flammable materials. Um, let's get that back. So, uh, yeah, you do have to... We do have to do the trick. You know how I toggle it in my, um... Eh. All right, there we go. In, uh, in my... Uh, yeah, we need that quick toggle. Wow! Oh yeah, there it goes. So one source block did all of that. We only need two, huh? Interesting. I thought we would need all eight, but it turns out we don't. So I wonder if I were to do something like this. Let's try this. Uh, let's mine this out. That makes things... Well, I guess it doesn't make things... Well, it does make it cheaper. I didn't have to go get all that lava. Um, but... Let's see what happens here. Okay. So let's um let's put this back in here. Interesting. Okay, um alright, so put it in here. Ding. Okay, so we'll go ahead and let that flow. And if it flows sideways, yeah. Oh no, see now oh right, of course it's not gonna work. I didn't put down any um put that back. Uh do that. And get our bucket back. It's not going to work because I didn't put down any string. Um, but it looks like it would really work. Uh, the only thing is, I think we should put it in each one because I want to quick trigger it. And uh, yeah, we don't uh, we don't want to have to do that uh, where <laughs> where things fall apart like it was. So uh, let's. Oh, and did it? No, it shouldn't have. It should still. Yeah. Okay. So it didn't mess up the water streams. Okay. Cool. So um, let's put these all in here, and then let me figure out how to trigger them quickly um, because uh, that is pretty much the rest of it. Uh, all we have to do is set it so that maybe we press a button and it'll make it for us. Um, I've seen some that have like special um, circuits that every time you remove something, it does it, but um, I don't think we need that. I think we just need a button um, that will trigger a pulse that is the right length. Uh, for us to do it. So uh, let me set up the redstone stuff um, for that. Um, how do I get in and out of here then? Oh, jump boost. Beautiful. Beep. Okay, cool. Nice. Um, I'll clear this out though because it's just too low. Ooh, that almost broke that. Uh, but yeah, okay, cool. So let me um, let me try and figure out how to um, how to make the pulse the right length. I mean, a regular button pulse might be enough. I'm not entirely sure but uh yeah i'll be back in a bit oh man i love the snapshot guys um it turns out just pressing the button twice yourself does it dun, dun, done that's it that's all it requires a button and a line of redstone and you just stand up there and hit it yourself i mean that really doesn't take any extra time at all and uh all the obsidian you could ever want and you don't have to really go anywhere you don't have to go find lava you don't have to waste any lava source blocks anymore i think it's pretty epic and it's so easy just some dispensers hook them up and uh, with the button on top thing that we can do now because um in 14w4 uh you can put buttons on top and bottom you just then listen for the sound and pop it back and you're well oops that was my fault <laughs> uh i screwed it up let me do that one more time for you guys Come on, let me out of the water, please. Gosh, or out of the uh, lava there. Uh, let's do that one more time, just so you guys can get a look. Okay, let's do that again. And, oh, right. Gotta put down the redstone or string. Uh, we don't have enough, but um, this should this should be, it should do it for three, four, five, and six. So we're gonna miss two, but watch. Listen for the sound. Hit it, and ah, it doesn't work with string. Interesting. Hmm, that's very interesting. Uh, so it does work, obviously, with the redstone. It doesn't work with the string. I'm totally okay with that, guys. So uh, I guess that's something, uh, something that they changed. Uh, and it made smooth stone here, which is weird. Um, so yeah, we'll get that fixed up. But uh, anyway. Um, wow, I messed this thing up now. <laughs> Let's go back here, uh, and we can, um, wow, bizarre. Uh, let me empty my buckets of water. Let's try that again. Pick this up. We'll just, um, pick up each bucket. It shouldn't have done that, but I don't know what happened there. 
Go there, go there, go there, go there, and go there. This does work! I'm gonna go get redstone to prove it. Uh, I'll be right back. All right, guys. I don't know what happened, but something happened with the uh, with the obsidian. I, I I mean, with the water. So I I just made a infinite source over there and, and broke all the water and uh, and then redid this. So let's try this one more time. Make sure that it does in fact work, and I'm not just like, oh, this is so easy, but it's not. So listen for the sound. Boom! There it is. Okay, sweet. So yeah, I think what it was is um is the fact that it was making different types of um of stone. And some made faster and others didn't, and it would sort of redirect the water flows underneath and uh, mess everything up. But this should be repeatable every time as long as you remember to put the redstone down. But if not, you can just uh, take up all the water, do it again. Let's try it one more time. Okay. And uh, like I said, it doesn't work with string. Don't know why, because these were originally done with just string, but I've got tons of redstone, so I'm not so worried. So press it once. Press it twice. Yes, beautiful. Look at all my lovely obsidian. <laughs> all right, guys, uh, I'm gonna mine some more obsidian here and I wanna do a little bit of housekeeping, uh, especially because the slime farm is gonna be coming soon. And I'm a little worried about placement with the, um, the skeleton XP farm. So uh, I'll be back in a second while I do that. Okay, and okay, I have no idea how that happened. Uh, Gosh, I don't know where anything is anymore. Oh wait, there's... Ah! Here we go. Um, let's put that there. That's a little better. And then I wanted to fix the stairs because I saw someone in the comments complaining. Like, dude, fix the stairs already. So I, I want them as... um, I want them as... Uh, wooden stairs, I think? I'm not... I'm still not sure. Oh, great. Just throw them up in the air. Way to go, dude. Uh, let's, let's do that. And then we'll just take them like this. It's quicker. Three, uh, let's go with 32. We'll grab these back. Okay, and we'll put them, I don't even, oh man, this is frustrating to not know where anything is anymore. I definitely need to put the item frames back because that's annoying and I made way too many. Wow, this, I forgot how fast this thing was, especially with haste. Okay, and uh, dut, 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 dut. oh, I hear slime in my slime farm area. But obviously it's not a slime farm yet. You know, I really wish that I hadn't built this so steep, but we had to. But anyway, eh, it's not bad. It's better. Okay, let's go over here and uh, kill our little... Oh, I think there's more than one. Oh yeah, look at our slime farm. We're jumping. We're jumping, everybody. Woohoo! Slime farm, slime farm. Wee! Yeah! Woohoo! Everybody, and look how high I jump with this jump boost. It's awesome. Okay, cool. So... This is only one layer, and we're going to make multiple layers in this slime farm area here. So we are going to be swimming in slime blocks. Sweetness. Wait, how do we even get out of here right now? Ah, here we go. I'm lost. Okay, so... um, Oh, well, let's see. So if I got this, I want some... Uh, let me get a little bit more stone. We should have a bunch in here still. Not good at timing my jumps anymore. Okay. Uh... And we got that. All right, so what I want to do is reconfigure the water stream in the XP farm area. And did I find, oh yeah, it was down here that we found, that we got, we clobbered it, right? Right here, was it, I think? Yep, okay. So um, the thing is, like, as you guys can see here, uh, well, and, and you guys know that in, not only in the XP farm, but also, in the uh well over this way in the um in our farm farm uh we do have an issue with uh what do you call it we do have an issue with um golly why can't i talk uh with the water and i had a really hard time making the farm there uh and it turns out that i was kind of noobish <laughs> Imagine that, right, guys? Uh, I was a little bit noobish when putting the water in here, and you don't really have to do it this way. Um, so let's go and make ourselves a... Um, we'll make ourselves... Wow. <laughs> this jump boost is nuts. Uh, let's make ourselves an infinite water source here. This thing is nuts. Um, here we go. So, uh, And what we'll do is uh, we'll reconfigure this uh, water, and then we can... 
then we're only going to be putting water in the in the exposed area that you see and not underneath here so because uh, we don't really need that uh so let's do that now let me think about how to do this um the right way let's 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 um let's go ahead and just knock this out here because it's getting annoying and oh there it is there's the source block right there so let's go ahead and block that block that block that and block that and there goes the source block um actually what i'll do is i'll go and get rid of all the source blocks on this side because we have our infinite water source anyway so let's just go through here and i'm not i can't quite see i think that's the edge um let's of course i don't uh let's <laughs> let's grab a torch here and that's not how you make a torch you know, I never really thought about it, but I, I thought that that might be a shapeless recipe. Okay, let's just make sure. No, I see it is a little bit further here. Okay, there it is right there. So we'll go through here. Oops, didn't mean to do that. That's okay. Is that up? Oh, and I blocked our water source. Dumb, dumb. Um, let's go ahead and put that there. And then we don't have an infinite source anymore, but we can just grab the water here. There we go and we'll grab another one there we go sweet now we'll just block this in. and nobody's really gonna we're never gonna see this so i'm gonna use cobble although we have a ton of stone um but this is this is gonna be gone for good anyway so it doesn't matter a whole lot but we want to block this off and the reason for that is we don't want mobs spawning in here and uh eating well i guess it wouldn't really eat the mob cap because um because well unless they're skeletons Actually, if it were if they were skeletons, would it eat it? Yeah, I think it would. I think it would count. Um, okay, so we're just gonna do that all the way around. And oh, that's weird. Uh, okay. Oh, that's that's interesting. Uh, why the? Uh, okay, whatever. Let's do that. Oh, nope, not that. Right. And. Keep it going, keep it going. And we got one more right here. Beautiful. And you guys remember the way it looks in here. I don't know, a lot of you probably haven't even seen it in here. Uh, the switch out um, out where the, the uh, skeletons drop turns off all this redstone here, and uh, which is what keeps the mobs from spawning. Um, well, yeah, it keeps the mobs from spawning when, when, when the lights are on. Okay, so what we want to do is, let's, um, we don't need this anymore and we got to do this on the other side as well and i'm going to be hopefully quicker with it this time because that was really slow i'm sorry about this guys uh come on we can talk a little bit about uh love life and minecraft don't you just love life and minecraft yeah that didn't go very well did it <laughs> um okay we'll just cut through here a little bit further, a little bit further, a little bit further, and that would be it. We'll block that all the way through. Nice. Okay. Well, whatever. Um, you know, it's weird. I always thought that these hallways were longer than they are. Let's go and block that. Uh, block it. Yeah, just make it easier to get up there. All right, sweet. But they aren't, so let's just block it off, block it off, block it off, block it off. I thought they were like eight long, but um, I think that they're eight long... At their end so these are only like four whoop, whoop. there we go broken there you go there you go and bunk, bunk. there it is okay now we are getting somewhere guys yes all right we can take this away okay so um what we need to do is make our water stream just match that um, so I'm going to block this off as well, so we can start from scratch here and we want our water. Let's see. So, uh, right. Okay. So here's the thing. Uh, we want our, um, the, uh, we want our height to be lower than this because, um, what'll happen is let's just say we do it like this. Um, the zomb the, uh, the skeletons will spawn here and, uh, oh no, they should, they should make it right under. Okay, great. That's even better. Uh, so what we do is we put it right. Um, should we put it here? I think that's where we want it. Yep. And 
That should go there, and let's see if it, it's the right width here. That should go there. And yeah, as you guys can see, it, uh, hold on a second, let's get rid of it. Uh, let's grab some more water here uh, from the middle and the middle. Uh, as you guys can see, and I don't think we're gonna need any more water. Uh, I think that we can do it just from those two source blocks. So let's make sure that it flows appropriately. And as you guys can see, uh, it starts to all flow toward the middle, right? But uh, it stops. So as you guys can see, everything here uh, flows right to that centerpiece, and that centerpiece goes down the middle, just like we had it before. But we need to go a little bit lower, so we should be able to do this. And it should all flow. Let's see if we can get it right. There we go. Just cut it all off. Um, all right. Let's see how this works. Yep. It does seem to work. Let's see. And that one, that one, and that one. Let's see if it all flows to the middle. And it should. Let's just pretend we're a skeleton. So, uh, how does what, skele what noise do skeletons make? No, they don't make that noise. But anyway, let's see what happens here. I'm a skeleton. I'm a skeleton. Nope, that doesn't work. <laughs> exactly. Um, I think if we put a source block here, though, it might. Uh, let's see. Yes, that's it right there. And one on this corner as well. There it is. So. All four corners should point to the middle now. Let's check it out. So if I spawn here, I get funneled to the middle, and I ride this down, and I'm in. Okay. Um, oh, you know what we can do? We can use cobblestone and just throw it everywhere. See what happens to it. Throw a little cobble, throw a little cobble, throw a little cobble. I'm picking it up. Um, throw it, throw it, throw it, throw it up there, throw it up there, throw it, 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 throw it. Throw it. Okay. Let's see if any cobble gets stuck. Oh, geez. Looks like everything is flowing toward... Uh, oh, no. See, that is not good. Um, okay, let's... Uh, I thought I could get it with the shape of the room. Let's put this up a little... Okay, let's grab that. So I think... Let's see if we do that. Um, Ah, there it is. That is how it should be. You see how this one flows, guys? Every single one flows toward the middle. Um, so we need to grab this and we just need to... Where did I put it? It was the one on... Is it... So it's that one, that one, and that one. It looks about the same. I don't... Oh, it fixed itself. Now, how did that happen? So now nothing should... Uh, should... That is bizarre. Huh. Huh. I'm not sure what updated. I think it was that block there. Uh, but it seems like everything will go now. So we'll throw a cobble everywhere. Whee! Okay, and let's see what happens. Throw some over there. Throw some over here. And we'll wait and see if it all comes our way. It looks like it's all coming our way. So this should be sufficient. Uh, let me step back far enough so... Uh, just to be sure that it's not cheating. Yeah, it is working. It is working, guys. We should get all of our cobblestone back. We'll just wait a little bit longer here. Make sure it all filters through. And I think that's good. And then that frees up... Um, I mean, it's just... It's almost an aesthetic thing. But it frees up the space that we... Uh, the space issues that we were having before. Uh, with things being under it. And it frees up, I mean, a good... Four blocks, I mean, four blocks on each side, so that is quite good. Let's see, make sure everything seems to work, everything seems to flow. So we're not going to end up with any skeletons getting stuck up there. Let's see if we can close this off from here. Yep, there it is. Okay, so um, do I have any glass? Yeah, I do. So we'll just break out here. All right, and let's give it one last shot to be sure. That, uh, that we've got this thing working. Let's turn it on. And let's take a little look. And I heard them spawn already, so that part's working. Oh, there's the first one. And um, it might have only spawned one. So uh, what we'll do is um, we can go and check in a minute uh, and just see if any get, have gotten stuck. We can just open up that, that hole 
uh, from the slime farm, but I don't think it's going to be an issue. It does seem to be uh, does seem to be working. Um, just doesn't seem to be spawning on that fast. Let's see. It's up oh, there's yeah. See those, so there's another one about to come. There he there he is right there. Yep. So yeah, here they are. They're coming now. Yep. Okay. Good. It looks like it's working just as uh, intended. Um, what I'll do is I'll turn the lights back on, and if there are any stuck there, it's not going to despawn them, but they'll be stuck. So let's check it out here. All right, and now they're starting to fall. It's great, so they'll do their thing. So everything seems to work the way it used to. Let's just check and see. Uh, as long as when I go here and we go through... Hey, buddy. Uh, and we go through, it should be fine. Um, uh, or there shouldn't be any that are just hanging out they should be all cleared out of the room well except for that guy but he uh he will get pushed out ah come on leave me alone <laughs> he's aggroed on me now uh let's peek through uh he's trying to see the only reason that that's happening is he's just trying to swim against it and and that doesn't worry me one bit because if i were in the other room he would come my way because he would think he could get me so it does seem to work yes okay good i'm glad because um that really means to me that uh, and there he is that's him right there nice beautiful and uh we can just hit him with water buckets one by one okay all right all right yep okay so anyway guys we uh we updated that and the reason i did that is just because um remember here i was having so much trouble with the ceiling and stuff um and we're going to have that problem on the other side when we start building and also um, with uh, with the map room and stuff. I didn't want to have to worry about uh, clobbering that room or having water underneath because um, we would actually run into that issue uh, over right around here because that's where that water was coming from. So it's all set. Let's go kill that slime because I want some more slime blocks. Woohoo! Slime farm. Nice. 15. Oh, we've almost got enough for two. Well, no, is it? No, 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 no. You need 18 but because it takes nine. But anyway, guys, if you enjoyed this episode of Minecraft Survival, please show your support. Give it a like. I really appreciate it when you guys like my videos. It really helps out. Also, this is your first time watching one of my videos. Become a noodler today. Go ahead and subscribe. It's free. It's fun. And it only takes the click of a button. <laughs> I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching. And of course, Noodle on!